Hello friends, welcome to the first episode of Ratinga Nag and Cyber Security. I will be definitely uploading videos based on this content. So stay tuned. Today we are going to install Tor and access the dark web. It's a big news tutorial, so more prayer knowledge is required. So without wasting any further time, let's get straight to the today's topic. So basically, when you use internet, normally your computer sends requests directly to the website and the website sends responses back to your computer. But when you use Tor, your requests get sent through a bunch of different computers first, which is also known as modes, and that each mode will only be able to see a small part of the request, so that nobody can see the whole thing. Now to download Tor, just open any browser of your choice and search for Tor. Just click on the official link which ends with an .org domain. Just click on download .org browser and here, if you are on Windows, download for Windows and if you are on Mac, download for Mac. Since we are on Linux, we will be downloading this. The size will be around 101 MB. This could change if you are watching this video data. Just locate the file. Just right click on it. Select extract here. Now open the folder, you will get two assets inside. One will be a directory and one will be a desktop shortcut. Now just right click on the shortcut and select execute. And then launch anyway. This will open our browser. Now here you can select connect and the browser will try to connect with the Tor network. It may take some seconds based on your internet connectivity. As you can see that it's successfully connected. You can search for hidden wiki. Hidden wiki is basically a collection of websites and web pages that are not indexed by regular search engines like Google, Bing or Yahoo. These websites are part of what is known as the deep web which is a part of internet that is not easily accessible through conventional means. So just click on this link. Although it's not the actual hidden wiki, we can get an official link from here. Note that the dark web websites will always have a .onion domain. So this is the official link. You can either bookmark it or save it somewhere else. As you can see, it's fully loaded. Now you can browse anything which you would like to know about the dark web. And also you can access some dark web websites too. I'd recommend to use the hidden wiki for a good purpose or you might get into some trouble. For example, I'll open the dark web Facebook for you. Again, it's up to you. Go ahead, explore the dark web and find out what you are looking for. So as you can see that Facebook is loading up. And I guess the video ends here. If you like this content and want to support my efforts, make sure to like this video, share them with your friends and subscribe to this channel and most importantly, enable notifications so that you may not miss any interesting contents like this on this channel. Thanks for watching, we'll meet in the next one.